Did you know that the atmosphere is polluted? Were you aware that groundwater is contaminated? You might not care much about these issues, but beware, the pollutant responsible has made it to our tissues. It's present everywhere now, and it's degrading our sphere. It also kills a million birds and sea animals each year. Yet the increases in its usage still remains drastic. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking about plastic. It's convenient to use and easy to make. But did you ever wonder what is at stake? While it's made from natural materials and not much is lost, if we don't slow down, our future is what it will cost. It cannot be burnt as it produces toxic fumes. To pile it up and store, a lot of space is consumed. Hence, we must rethink its need and proceed with caution. Because, along with land and air, it also destroys the ocean. Lots of animals ingest plastic every day. Fish and seabirds mistake it for their prey. If we continue to recklessly dispose plastic into the sea, there will be more plastic bottles than fish by 2050. Now, if you're wondering what we can do, well, in that case, ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you. Don't just sit at home and wait. Go out there, find people, and educate. Now, stepping out these days might be a challenge, but with internet at our disposal, we can still manage. So search up the facts and take a good look and share them on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. But what about the waste that meanders into the deep seas? For that, I designed a ship, Erebus, which will slurp it in with ease. Maybe today, the idea sounds a bit sublime. But I promise, with your help, we'll be there in no time. When it comes to nature, plastic has no merit. Is this a plasticated world, what we want to inherit? Let's solve this problem together, you and me, because we must be the change that we want to see. Thank you.